The story of Christmas be began long, long ago when God promised to send a Savior. The chosen people of Israel waited thousands of years for the Savior to come. Now, when God was ready to give Jesus to the world, he chose a good and pure woman named Mary to be his mother. And she was engaged to be married to Joseph, a humble carpenter who lived nearby. One day, when Mary was alone, God sent his messenger, the angel Gabriel, to appear before her. Hail Mary, the Lord is with you. Do not be afraid, Mary, for you have found favor with God. He has chosen you to bring forth a son. You shall call him Jesus, and he will be called the Son of God, and his kingdom shall have no end. It came to pass in those days that a decree went out from Caesar Augustus, that all the world should be counted so they could be taxed. All the people are to go to the cities and towns from which their families have been born. Since Joseph had come from the family of King David, he and Mary left Nazareth to go to Bethlehem in Judea. But when they arrived, the city was already very crowded, and all of the inns were full. One innkeeper took pity on them and gave them the use of a stable in the back of his inn. The stable was for animals, for the donkeys, cows, and sheep that people had brought with them. But Mary and Joseph were grateful. While Mary and Joseph were in Bethlehem, they gave birth to their first son. She wrapped him in wildling clothes and laid him in a manger. Some shepherds were guarding their sheep. All at once, an angel come, came down to them from the Lord, and the brightness of the Lord's glory flashed around them. The shepherds were frightened. Do not be afraid. I have good news for you, which will make everyone happy. This very day in King David's hometown, a Savior is born for you. He is Christ the Lord. You will know who he is, because you will find him wrapped in swaddling clothes and lying in a manger. Suddenly, many angels came down from heaven and joined in praising God. Glory to God in the highest, and peace to all people. Peace to all people. So they went in haste and found Mary and Joseph and the infant lying in the manger. In another part of the country, there were three kings. They saw a bright star in the sky. They knew it was different from all the rest. They followed the star to Bethlehem. The three kings found Mary, Joseph, and the infant, Jesus, in the stable. The wise men fell on their knees in humble worship. They lay at the feet of baby Jesus, the valuable treasures they had brought with them to honor him gold, frankincense, and myrrh. They knew they had at last found their savior, God's son, who had come to bring peace on earth on that silent and holy night. And this is the children's version of the story of Jesus' birth. Yay, praise Jesus! Yay! <laughs> 
Thank mm-hmm. you.